today's question is i've got cancer and my family is insisting on surgery and chemotherapy what should i do and another question was can cancer with metastasis really be cured with a whole food plant based diet so to answer this here's what i believe there's no one answer for all cases of cancer but chemotherapy is a poison and chemotherapeutic drugs even cause cancer but the reason they're given when someone has cancer is because they can kill all fast growing cells and this is important because cancer cells are also fast growing cells red blood cells and white blood cells and hair cells and skin cells and mucous membrane cells are fast growing cells the chemotherapy also destroys the gut bacteria and so chemotherapy has so many side effects but sometimes it can be good however many times people take chemotherapy more than required out of fear and that's because you know doctors have certain protocols of how much chemotherapy to take i would always suggest that if it's causing more harm than good don't continue because ultimately chemotherapy doesn't help you build a strong body the it's the same with radiotherapy radiotherapy is x-rays and we all know that x-rays cause cancer the good thing about the radiotherapy is that it's localized and it causes burning of the cancer cells localized so it has all the side effects of a burn and it takes time to heal and so if we can prevent chemotherapy and radiotherapy this would be really good and surgery too you can't cut cancer out because cancer cells are everywhere and that brings us to the next question of metastasis so even if we cut out the cancer it can recur and if you have metastasis it means it has spread so what do we do there in order to get rid of cancer we need to have a beat cancer mindset it means one should be willing to do whatever it takes to beat cancer in order to beat cancer we need to have all, all the things that we can possibly do the first is that we should eat food which is suitable to our species that means not just a whole food plant based diet but if possible 100% raw if you can't eat too much raw or even if you can't eat too much you can still have raw vegetable juices and that's advisable as well but that's just food we can do other things as well sleep should be great remember the more rest you take the more you recover and so we should give healing priority when we have cancer take as much rest as you can as much rest as your body demands and definitely sleep between 10 and 4 because that's the special healing time so between 10 and 4 and as much more that you can sleep you should sleep the second thing is exercise move as much as you can without causing any injury or pain the third thing is take away all the electromagnetic frequencies like mobile phones and stay away from mobile phone towers and don't eat foods made in a microwave and take away all those remotes and TVs and watch films that make you laugh listen to bhajans or spiritual songs and get plenty of fresh air and sunshine and the most important thing is mind because resentment and also anger they fuel cancer so we need to take these out of our system forgive everyone recognize that what they are doing are things that you have done yourself sometime too and everyone makes mistakes and everyone needs to be forgiven and loved and you need to get rid of all this anger from your body so i want to recommend some really good books if you are working to heal cancer and i do want to say that you know some of these people have healed grade 4 cancer and metastasis 
and they've even gone on to do uh, get into fitness and get healthier bodies and help so many other people so two great books that i want to recommend is chris beat cancer which tells you all the physical things that you should do and you can heal your life by louise hay which tells you how to work on your mind in fact it could be even great to have a counselor when you're healing for cancer because we want to put in everything we can at that time so that we can really prioritize healing and get well as soon as possible remember in cancer we don't have time we can't wait do it as soon as you can